At the end of August 2005, Hurricane Katrina battered the Mississippi Gulf Coast. The area is starting to show signs of healing. Two years later, let people know that we're still needing volunteers, and we'll need for years to come. That things are still pretty desperate on the coast, and when we can scrounge up, you know, materials, it's hard to scrounge up a, uh, able body hands.、Um, there's just not enough construction people. On the coast to handle the need that we have, so we are going to continue to need volunteers for a long time to come. Lutheran congregations across the U.S. Gulf Coast have established camps or created space and facilities for volunteers coming to help restore the area, and they've been warehousing donations of food, clothing, bedding, furniture and appliances, building supplies and tools. Right now, we have、uh, financial support for another two years.、Um, we've got、uh, several houses under construction right now. Several of them that we have completed. I think、uh, we have somewhere in the neighborhood of 850 that this camp or the people that have been here have completed. And then there's an, there's another 1,200 on the books yet of people that need help、uh, in the future. We have the impression across America, I think that、uh, you know, it's been two years, and so the damage from Katrina is cleared up.、Uh, people are back in their homes, families are back in their homes. Well, that's far from the truth. You know, we're we're at year two, and we're now one third of the way through the journey. So, you know, don't get the impression that、uh, that we're finished. We we need you coming down to Bethel next week, and the week after that, and next year. And you know, I. I I can easily see this rebuilding effort going on for five more years. Lutherans are concerned about more than just the buildings, so the camps and congregations spend time talking with the volunteers and the people they help. Together, they surround their work in worship and counseling. We have children who were four and five years old when this happened, who are going to be carrying this for years. This is going to take a generation to get over, and、uh, this is not to say. For us, feel sorry for us. This is to say that people are still really hurting down here and still need a lot of help.、Uh, it could take literally years, years,、um, and then some of this will never be over. The trauma,、uh, the sights, the smells, the sounds that these people experience—that'll never go away.、Um, we can try to lessen it. We can try to give them hope, hope of the gospel and good news. But you know, it's still there. The bloom is off the rose, and the excitement about a current disaster has moved on to other places. The people here are still dealing with Katrina, and they will be dealing with Katrina for years and years and years. So, what do we need people to know? We need the Good Samaritan to come and do long-term recovery here. It's what the Bible calls us to do and calls us to be: is Samaritans for our neighbor. Lutheran congregations of the Gulf Coast have organized a blitz to attract volunteers. A dozen sites, from Texas to Mississippi, total more than 900 beds, with kitchen, dining, and shower facilities. All have space to relax. Some have internet access. Most ask for a donation to help cover room and board. Together, the sites organize more than 5,500 work projects. Information is on the web at futurewithhope.org. Frank Imhoff, the Mississippi Gulf Coast.